Good news, students. National Double Homework Month is officially over. Yay! Good news, students. Triple Homework Month commences. Aww. Worst news, students. The Wayside Tetherball Squad is on a losing streak. Back in the day, we ruled the pole. <laughs> Just look at this photo, children. Impressive, isn't it? So I thought to myself, what better way to inspire our team than to show them the moves that won my tether triumph? <laughs> That a wonderful demonstration to watch, class. Mrs. Jules, how can we see something that we're only hearing on the PA speaker? It's elementary, my dear Todd. You must look very closely. Mrs. Jules, Todd is right. If we want to win, we need to be inspired by someone we can actually see. <gasps> like a colorful mascot. A colorful was a what? A mascot. <laughs> It's an animal costume or a character designed to inspire fans. They can make you laugh at losing or cheer you to the championship glory. Yes, we need a mascot to take us to the next level. Someone unafraid of the shameless praise and applause that comes with the job. Someone who can lead us to leadership. Go, Myron! You mean, go team! Go what? I know who inspires me. Don't you think Todd would make a great mascot, Fluffy? I think Todd would make a wonderful mascot. Me? I'm not an animal or a funny character. Plus, I don't know how to inspire people. I mean, I'm not some guy who can just stand up in front of a bunch of people and tell them exactly what to do. So put that idea right out of your mind, people. Yay! I must sit down now. Why, just the name Todd brings out my inner warrior. Todd! Sorry, guys, I can't do it. You need someone who's larger than life. That's not me. I'm just Todd. He's right. He is just Todd. And it's probably for the best. Supposed to be me? Oh no, of course not, Todd. That's our new school mascot, Todd. Big head Todd inspires me so. Give me a W! W! Give me a Z! Z! That's not me. No, but it's someone who's like you, but bigger, louder, and larger than life. It was your idea, remember? What? That's ridiculous. And how come I have no arms? I ran out of paper mache building the giant head so my arm could fit inside it. Laces! Okay, now win that tetherball game. Yay!
enough air inside your big head, Todd. Just breathe through your mouth, or rather my mouth. <gasps> You're really doing a great job out there, Todd. Uh, big head Todd, uh, Myron. Water must drink. We actually might win the international championships now. I don't think I could have ever inspired us to do that. It's weird. I kind of even admire you, Todd. I wish I was you, Todd. Not because you're cool and famous, but because you have hands. Big Head Todd! There you are. With the championships coming up, I think we really need to make your cheering stunts more challenging. In this, Todd? I have no arms, and it's lined with chicken wire. You can't disappoint the fans over some severe pain and discomfort. That's just not the Big Head Todd way! Ah. Such is the price of fame. Yeah! Hooray! Oi, oi, oi! Go, Mama Land! Oh, I no can believe my home country come here to play leather balls. I'm so excited, Sammy! Greeting! Bleh! Do you do, comrade? Do nothing! It's a blowout! I'm just so proud of these whatchamacallits. Dana wants me to step up my game, huh? This triple sow cow front summy to a round off back handspring ought to do it! little man in there. I not realize it cost you me there. He just look like Dimitri. The me, the me, the me. No! It's true what they say. Fame is fleeting. And so, alas, are big head mascot costumes. We're gonna lose. We're gonna lose. We're gonna lose. Oh, no. What are we going to do without Big Head Todd? Oi! 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 The Todd you want has an oversized head and no arms. Dana, I can't do this. I don't know how to cheer or do big head acrobatics. All I can do is be myself. It's all we ever wanted in the first place, Todd. Yay! Okay, I guess I could try. Go team! Yeah! What understated confidence! This Todd doesn't need fancy flips. He just needs this. Oh! 
salute you with our thumbs. Give me a W. W. Give me a Z. Z. Give me a seven. Seven. What's it spell? Target I would make. Uh. Tag, you're it. I know who I'm going to tag. Me? Oh, Todd. Uh oh. No, I'm it. <laughs> Please, Todd, don't tag me. That would be oh so awful. You want to be it so badly? Here. I don't think so. Only I'm it. Me. I am it. What's up with him? Don't you get it? Myron is it. That makes him the most powerful kid on the playground. And you know how Myron is about power. I am in charge. I am it. Why don't we just pick someone else to be it? You can't do that. It's against the rules. Says who? Says me. The honorary wayside rules sheriff. And it's all here in my rule books. Whoa, these are all rule books? <sighs> Volume four of 36. The person who is it is the most powerful person on the playground. He or she is in charge and will decide who is next to be it. Most people accept being it as just part of the game. But Myron takes it a little too seriously. He who is it must be comfortable. This is so not right. Hey, I know. I'll take the tag back. I call returnsies. I'm still it. Volume 23, section 472, paragraph 17. No returnsies. I love rules. Rules, rules, rules. Isn't it wonderful how there's a rule for everything? Do you mind? Hey, gotta wait your turn. Haven't you heard? I'm it! Remember the rules? There could be germs on the tap. Mm. Now take a drink for me. Glug, 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 glug! Ah, refreshing. Ooh, he's it, remember? 847, 848, 840. Uh, rules. Sorry, girls. The boys' room's just too far today. Those are the rules. Make way. Coming through. I can't watch him treat us this way anymore. Is that so? Well, Todd. If you don't want to watch, pull your shirt over your head. What? You know the rules. Hmm? Mrs. Jules! Todd, did I hear you were breaking a rule? Do I have to write your name on the discipline list? Ugh. Ow! 
Now this Julius Caesar guy, he knew how to be it. Fortunately, so do I. More grapes! Yum, yum, yum. Where's my entertainment? Mrs. Jules, can't you do anything about Myron? Sorry, Todd, I'm staying out of this. He's it. And as a teacher, I must follow the rules too, even the rules of tag. Lord Myron, may I be excused? Dana, Myron's really out of control. You're the only one who can stop him. You're the sheriff of rules. You're talking about rebellion. Dance, dance. This is kind of normal, right? Besides, rules are rules. Ah, that's better. Dana, what will it take to convince you? What will it take? Hey, what are you up to? Nothing. I'm certainly not plotting a rebellion against you. Oh, you're up to something, all right. I'd say you're up to four feet. How dare you be taller than he who is it? Eric, Eric, Eric! Make me taller! Use those books over there! What are you doing? Those are the rule books! So? 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 Using rule books that way is a violation of Section 6, Subchapter 17, Paragraph 2. In case you've forgotten, I'm it. Whatever I say goes! You wouldn't be it if it weren't for those rule books. Hmm. <gasps> What are you doing? You're just going to make Myron angrier. Exactly. Watch. Oh, Myron. Huh? More books. More books. Higher. I must go higher. Aha! Myron, stop it. No one can stop me, because to do that, you'd have to break a rule, and you can't do that. It's against the rules. See how that works? Uh, must break rule. Can't break rule. Dana, you can do it. You can break a rule. I believe in you. See how easy it is? Hey, put that back on! You broke a rule. Start with an easy one. Here, have a grape. No eating my grapes! Dana! Give me that back! Cat! <gasps> See, Dana? You can't break a rule, but I'll make it easy on you. From now on, no more rules! Dana? The rule book? No more rules. No more rules. No more rules. <laughs> no more rules. No, Myron. You can't have it. What? You have to do what I say. I'm it. R remember the rules? What rules? Uh-oh. Myron, come back here and tag me. Oh, sorry. before you wanted to be it. Now look at us. We're fighting. We never used to fight. I got so wrapped up in the rules, I forgot the most important rule. Be good to your friends. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, 
be good to your friends. And, uh, I'm still your friend, aren't I? You're my best friend, Myron. From now on, I won't just be it. I'll be a better it. Come here and give me a hug, my bestest best friend. Aw. Uh, did I just... Did he just... Yes! He tagged me! I am it! What? No! You did that on purpose! Well, yeah. Sort of. No fear! Hey, it was for your own good. But if it makes you feel any better, I meant everything I said before, best friend. Oh, me too. All right. Now, as my one and only act of being it, I declare that all ways I rules are back in play! <gasps> Did I just...? Nice going, Dana. Now the cow is it. Myron, you know the rules. We only speak its language now. What I meant to say is... Moo, 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 moo. Moo, 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 moo. Oh, 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 oh,